this like so. Marvellous. I apologise if there's a slight bit of, um, you know, just like a little pixelation at the top or bottom. That'll just be where the window cuts off. I apologise. Sonic Veering Right sounds like he's on Facebook Q pages. <laughs> it's a weird one because you would have thought analog sticks would make an okay thing for a trackball, but no, yeah, it is extremely strange how they just can't get it to work. So as you can see, this is uh, the debut appearance of one, Ray the Flying Squirrel, and number two, Mighty the Armadillo, who are both going to be appearing in future Sonic games, but uh, this is Ray's only Sonic game up until Sonic Mania Plus. Mighty appears in Chaotix, so we'll be seeing him again uh, over the course of the month. But yeah, for a good old while, this was the only game that Ray appeared in. I love Mighty as well. Yeah, he he's one of the... Obviously, in you know, he's in Chaotix, and he's one of the Chaotix crew in Sonic the Comic who are in that version of the continuity. They're basically the Fantastic Four, but funny animals, you know, because they're, they're constantly bickering and infighting, and it's, it's very funny. Right. Let's stick some credits in here. I am going to be absolutely spamming the heck out of the credits button this evening, guys, because this is a very difficult game to control, and I'm going to die a lot, and I'm absolutely not going to be collecting very many rings, so when I get to the end of each level and it's telling me I've got like 4% of the rings, I apologise in advance. IxeGM, hello, welcome to the chat. Where's Big the Cat? He's not here today. He ain't coming. Alright, let's roll. Say I'm controlling this with uh, with the arrow keys. It's not actually too terrible. Whoa. Twelve percent of the rings. Wonder why they didn't go with Ray in the uh, don't go with Tails in the spot. Isn't Ray meant to be a fast girl? Yeah, the sound effects are rough, Omar. That is, it is kind of weird, I guess, that they didn't put Tails in the game. But I suppose they just wanted to expand Sonic's cast of friends. By the way, sorry that it's so weird looking on the screen. Um, me being sort of squished off to the side there. That was basically the only way I could... Uh, Rain this window properly. Oh no! Expect a lot of deaths in this game.
That's a fair point there, uh, LOMDR, so hello, welcome. I guess in a, an arcade you wouldn't hear all of the music because it'd be drowned out by all the other games. <laughs> Yeah, so this is, uh, I guess this is the second <laughs> bit of voice acting we've had for Sonic. He, uh, he had lines in uh, Wacky Wacky Sonic Patrol card, didn't he? Different voice, I think. Is it dark? Now the game's supposed to be turned to the music based games. <laughs> oh god, whoa. Good God, he just straight up died. Oh my God, this is ridiculous. So, why isn't Ray in the movie too much sexual magnetism? They have to give my a rating. What is wrong with you? So well, as you can probably tell. Oh, God. Sorry, guys, I'll uh, have a look at chat in a second when things are a little bit less insane. Oh, God. Missing persons joking, uh, <laughs> yes, in generations. Played some Sonic 2 and Origins last night. Hate how the special stages have changed with the graphic yeah. update. My brain was playing my flesh and rings, and now my timing is way off of them. Yeah, it's it's a bugger. I had a similar problem when I played Sonic Mania, because um, the blue sphere stage was in there in the, the first 14 stages of the original ones, and it, it, the smooth scrolling yeah, really yeah. messes with me. Was Origins remake to the first four consoles in Mania's engine? Uh, it wasn't technically a remake. I think it's more of a reassembly. They weren't done like from the ground up or whatever. Oh come on! Now. Making Sonic run into things a little like an idiot. Ah! I. I kind of agree, when there's no way that this was just the tribal problem, this is clearly designed to eat your coins. Everybody's favourite. 
Holy moly. Okay, well, if you blow it in the last level, you don't get any continues. Yeah, I, I'm going to be honest, guys, there's no way we're getting the good ending for that. Like, not a chance. This is one of the reasons Classic Sonic was voices in generations. Yeah. About 20% of the rings. We did well that time. Game design track balls act weird with digital input. Some stuff is remastered and the ratio has changed. The engine doesn't change for the main gameplay. Wow, aside from a few physics. Uh, yeah, I watched a. Uh, Watch like a DVD bonus feature interview with Jaleel White. He he definitely does look. Oh my god! No, definitely does look different now to uh, how he did back in the day. Sonic, would you just? Would you just? He wouldn't just. Let's pretend that he did. It was, uh, it was on the Sonic Underground DVD, and I think it was pretty well clear that there's no way he could do that voice anymore. Oh no, no, no! Oh, I didn't do that. Get out of the wall. Stupid. <laughs> Oops. Oh, He's not having a good day, is so. Oh my sweet Jesus above. Precision control is my favourite. Maybe out this one for a while, guys. Jesus above. Panic. This is nightmare. Right, that was just instant fucking death. Panic. Sonic torture simulator. This it definitely does work better with the track ball. Um like there's this video game. This video has been playing on YouTube for trying to look really close back to Galloping Ghost Arcade in Chicago revived Primal Rage 2. Wild Waterway, right. Apparently this level sucks without a track ball, so... You may just have to bear with me, guys. Oh, no. Oh, God. What was I meant to do that? Oh, okay, cool. That seems really fair. For once, I genuinely feel like that was the game's fault. <laughs>
Although I've got to say, so far, not so terrible. Having a bit of time with this one than I did the last level, I think. Please give some more, so I know it's not the time for that. Someone on Twitter said that I should keep the track of it how many times I end up dangling over the edge. As I said to him, I was like, let's not make that a really good thing. Oh god. Oh god, why? Right, apparently... This is one of those where you kind of just gotta suck it up and die a lot. If you're not playing with a track ball. Super imprecise, apparently. Never mind, we uh, bludgeoned our heads against it and got down there. No, it's not a thing that would silly. Oh my god. Waterway is too wild for me. Oh. This is horrendous. This is probably like the kind of... I feel like this is a game that Robotnik would have on his computer to... <laughs> like, imagine, you know, envision what it would be like killing Sonic constantly. Try playing Marble Madness with mouse under control, that's not a good solution. See, I, w I was going to do it using the mouse as the trackball, but then I realised, aha, doesn't have a ball, does it? to the track ball is it helped up to your gateway computer win <laughs> running Windows 95. Exactly! I haven't had to use a track ball on a mouse in a good old while. Aside from uh, at my uh, former place of employment where technology made after 1998 is simply not welcome. Alright guys, we're near the end so there's not too much of this torture that I need to endure for I don't think there's any... Oh, here we go. Here he is. Uh -oh. Well, time to get the bad ending. So close. <laughs> Damn it. I failed. I did as well. <laughs> it 
Imagine if that was a real arcade machine and we just put in coin after coin for that to happen and for me to not even end up on the board. I'm sure he's fine. I'm sure he got out A-OK. -okay. Loads of Sonic games. He must be fine. Must be.